everyone. This is Kristen Brindley, publisher of DC Metro Real Producers. I'm on with the wonderful Rebecca Lombardo of True Place. Thank you so much for being on. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Absolutely. You know, um, so True Place is a super valued partner and they are, uh, they were just in the March issue and check it out uh, on the private Facebook group and, you know, on Digipub on the digital version as well. And True Place, uh, they've won tons of awards. They're a huge innovator in the industry, HGTV, in the news. They've been featured on Washington Post, Luxury Home Magazine. And uh, they have a lot of programs that are, are directly to our rising stars and the teams. Um, they actually did focus groups and figured out pain points and truly answered the, the issues um, in the industry for teams and have focused programs for that. And their page views on their websites are up 268% year over year because of product improvements. So tell us, what does True Place do, Rebecca? So a big part of, of getting to everything that you're speaking about is, is innovation and technology. And it really helps um, the businesses who have technology leaders at the helm, having Bob and Susie, who started this company over 17 years ago, be innovators and drivers of that technology innovation have been huge. So when you look at the difference between True Place and other companies, understanding that Bob has this great ability to focus on technology, to focus on innovation, knows what he's doing, is really talented with that. That's a big driver of what keeps us ahead. Absolutely. Well, and so you're a, can you speak more to exactly what True Place does as well, which is, you know, the virtual tours, photography, like, can you speak a little bit more exactly to what y'all, y'all do too? Yeah, absolutely. So what we do is we focus on quality property visuals. So that means that we take all of the high quality photography that we do. And when we go to do a walkthrough video, or if we go to do a 3D tour, we don't just turn and use the next best technology that everybody else is using. We say, okay, that quality that's in the photography, how do we get that to carry through all of the other visual products as well? So how do we get the quality we see in that HDR camera? You know, how do we get that into the walkthrough video? How do we get that into a 3D tour? We don't wanna just use whatever product or tool everybody else is using. We wanna go out and research and find what is gonna keep the quality so high in a walkthrough video or in a 3D tour, we're going to abandon everything else and just say, then that's what we're going to go with. So did you always think that you'd be part of this, this visual tours and photography type company? Did you always think you'd be involved with something like this? No, I never thought I would be a part of something like this, like a photography company for real estate. Did not see that coming. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it has been an interesting journey. I always kind of describe my journey as uh, more of a jungle gym rather than a ladder that you know goes up the corporate ladder. So it's been a fun jungle gym, but I'm, I'm thrilled to be here. It allows me to put my experience in photography and my passion with photojournalism together with real estate sales uh, for a company that honestly, I say they are worth working your nights and weekends for. They're such good people. They are great people. And, and you are the vice president of um, marketing and sales. So you're wearing both those hats, right? Yes. I'm, <laughs> we're, we're all wearing a couple of hats right now. <laughs> well, and growing quickly. Yeah. So, um, you know, can you take me a step-by-step -step process of like what True Place went through to get to where they are today? Sure. So when I first started, we read Measure What Matters. It's a really important book to get everybody rowing in the same direction. It focuses on what they call OKRs, which are objectives and key results. And that helps leadership decide what their objective and key results are gonna be. And it trickles down throughout the rest of the company. So what came next? So after we decided what our objectives and key results were gonna be for the company, the pandemic came next. Like literally the pandemic came right after that. So after I came on board, we have, you know, we're all on the same page, we're all gonna go in the same direction and boom. Global pandemic hits. Just a little. <laughs> just just a little little tiny thing. And you know, I was on a, a podcast with ProTech, our friends over at ProTech. Yeah. And, and they were asking us about the pandemic and, and what was the best thing through that and what was the worst thing. And I was like, that actually was the same thing. The best thing and the worst thing was the pandemic because it forced all of us to really hunker down on those objectives. And the objectives were servicing our clients, making everything easy for them. Uh, relationships, you know, Bob and Susie are very focused on relationships. And so 
During the pandemic, I think we saw the best of True Place because we stayed so laser focused on making sure the real estate agents that were working with us had everything they needed in an easy, high quality way and nothing else mattered. It was, it was just get this to them, get this to them in the best way possible and it, we'll figure everything else out later. That is beautiful. And that does not surprise me with True Place. So let's, let's get to the, the, the dirt, the real stuff people want to know about, like, um, you know, what is it um, that you all do to get business? Like, how do you, how do you all get business? So, so I'm working with so many talented people and, and it's great because everybody brings such a strong uh, suit of skills to the table. It's great working with such talented people, getting again, everybody rowing in the same direction and getting focused on the client. Um, that's what we've been focused on organizing over this last year. Part of focusing on the client and organizing around them is understanding their pain points. And so what we did was we took a look at, you know, the rising stars and the teams who love working with us. And we understood their workflows are different. Those, those teams are different. They don't, it's not the same as working with an individual agent. And so we recreated an infrastructure inside True Place to support teams and how they work and what their pain points are so that that accommodates them rather than the other way around. That makes a lot of sense to me. Um, so uh, do you advertise and what's your main focus in, in that arena? So being head of marketing and sales, I've got, I've got a foot in each boat. I'm always thinking about marketing, but I'm always thinking about sales. So yes, we're, we're doing advertising. Obviously the real producer community is a huge part of that. We do have Google ads running. I would say our email marketing, every time we send an email out, we know we're taking precious, precious time away from the agents who are super busy. So if we don't contribute value in every single email, we don't send the email. So we want to make sure that we're constantly bringing value to the table in our emails, that we're constantly, you know, sending the right message out with our advertising, again, trying to speak to those pain points and explain to them through an ad or, you know, through the email, like we understand, we hear you. Um, we're also, again, innovating, not just with our technology, but with some of the packages that we're putting together. So we have real estate residential packages that are thinking for the agent. So you're super busy. You just, you know what you need, you need a tour, you need a marketing piece. So we put together a package that has one of everything and there's three different versions. So if you love 3D tour, there's a package with that. If you love walkthrough, there's a package for that. So you don't have to constantly think about all the different pieces you need for that house. You just order the signature package or order the classic package because you know that that's what you need. And it's got everything in there. There are three things in every package, one marketing piece, one tour, one enhancement, boom, you're done. Nice. It sounds, it sounds simplified to truly what they need and, um, not overcomplicated. Trying to keep it simple. Yeah. (laughs) Um, so what's been the biggest challenge during, you know, COVID and I mean, it was the biggest blessing and the biggest like, you know, hardship, but like, what's, what's been the biggest challenge do you think for true place? Gosh, I think the hardest thing that has happened through the pandemic is not being able to see my friends. <laughs> there are so many great people that we work with and not being able to see them face to face, to look them in the eye, to shake their hand, say, hey, congrats on such and such. You know, we're relationship driven people. And so not being able to see somebody in person, not being able to communicate with them. And, you know, I pay attention to things like body language. You know, I, I pick up other cues and so I'm <laughs> trying to like connect with people over a Zoom. No, I mean, this is great, but like, I, I need to be in person. I think that's been the hardest thing is like, I really miss these people. Um, I miss seeing them. Same. <laughs> Gosh, I agree with you. Um, what, do you what do you believe has um, been most rewarding? Oh my gosh, um, the thing that's been most rewarding has probably been seeing the success of the clients that we work with. Um, Brian Felder is doing amazing things. Eric Stewart's team is doing amazing things. Meredith Fogel is doing amazing things. And so to be able to work with these people, you know, kind of in a behind the scenes way and then see them achieve such amazing success and they, they share it on social, you know, and, and so you can see it, it just feels so good to, to be a part of supporting that success. What do you think um, sets you apart and makes True Place, you know, different? So this is a really good question, right? Because residential photography 
it's available if you need it. <laughs> there, there, <laughs> you will not have a hard time finding somebody who can provide residential photography. Um, so I think what makes True Place unique, um, and, and honestly, it's really about finding the right fit, right? So I think you need to understand what each vendor kind of brings to the table and just find what's right for you. So True Place is really focused on the infrastructure of supporting teams um, based on their program, based on how they place orders, based on how we deliver the orders. So we're really focused on that and we have the flexibility to support that even down to, do you want monthly billing? Okay. You know, it, 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 do you want an online order form that's co-branded that you get copied on and we, okay. There are just so many flexible points, you know, for teams that I would say that that's something to look for. You know, if, if you're a team and you need a partner who can just flow with you and make it seamless and easy, um, that's us. Like that's what we're designed to do because we're also in the background, like you said, working on the technology, working on the innovation. You go out there, you sell homes, you be a rock star. Meanwhile, back at the ranch, we're going to focus on making sure that that interactive floor plan tour is highest quality, sharpest interactivity, constantly making upgrades. You don't, you should not be thinking about that. Like we will think about that. The other thing that makes us uh, different is going to be um, the way that we support the packages. Like I said, it's, it, we're thinking ahead. We're thinking for the agent. Uh, we're also thinking about everything you need to do. So our focus is on making it easy, soup to nuts. And that means we're going to provide everything, including virtual staging. We're going to integrate printing into the capabilities. So once you log into your client portal and you want to be able to just click on that photo and click on that brochure template, boom, you're done. You're on your way. So everything is going to be integrated. We want it to be completely seamless. We don't want you to have to do one vendor for a still photo and then another vendor for virtual staging and enhancements. We want to be a one-stop shop so that you can just do everything start to finish. That is beautiful and very helpful. Um, what else, what do you feel is True Place's strength? Like if you were to think about the strength of True Place, what, what do you think that that is? I would say the strength of True Place is our focus on quality, regardless of what kind of product it is, and our customer service support, which is bar none. So how do you all get clients? What does that look like for you? Um, yeah. So I, I mentioned earlier that we get, you know, we get some clients through our advertising, um, through our email marketing that gets shared, but seven out of 10 of our clients came to us through a referral. So that means that when agents say, hey, who do you use? They say true place. That's beautiful. That's fantastic. Um, so what's the next big step in the business? What do you plan to do differently in say one to five years? What does that look like for true place? You know, it's funny because I think people used to ask the question of like, you know, where do you see this in five years? And now that we've had the polar vortex in Austin and a global pandemic, and now I think the cicadas are coming. I, I, don't, <laughs> think, like, I don't think that anybody has a plan for five years. I think it's like, can we survive the next quarter? <laughs> like, I think we're actually still in Q5 2020 right now. <laughs> so <laughs> I, I think it's less about like, what do you, what do you see in five years? Uh, I think it's more about, you know, where do you see this quarter or this year, you know, coming out of, out of the pandemic. So we're, again, we're really focused on making sure everything is very easy uh, to use with True Place. Easy, easy is the big, big focus for True Place. Where I see us evolving from that is getting better at every step of that easy. So easy to find, easy to buy from us, easy to repeat order. I think the big focus is understanding that technology is a huge part of that. And we're so fortunate to have a co-founder who is you know, really good and talented at technology and can support every step of that journey you know, for our clients who need the support in terms of tour links, analytics, client portal logins, access to APIs for printing out your brochures. We're so fortunate to have you know, Bob at the helm to, to be able to know what to do with all of that. <laughs> A hundred percent. So why is it so important to work with a really high quality virtual tour company, photography company, and this era of real estate? So that's a good question because there are a lot of DIY products out there and iPhones are constantly evolving to have higher quality. So I, I think it's important to understand that every visual you attach to a property, you're attaching that visual to your brand. And, and these real estate agents are working so hard on their brand and they're really investing in that. And so to like stop just short of the goal line 
with using an iPhone photo on a front exterior, I'm like, oh, you, your brand. <laughs> so I, I think it's really important to understand that that's going to carry through, right? So please use professional photography to, for anything that reflects your brand because um, you're heavily invested in that. And it's, it's bad to, to get so close and, and, and have it so, you know, it permeates so much of the work that you're doing. And then just, oh, well, it's just a coming soon shot. I'll just take it with my iPhone. Uh, that, that could possibly devalue that property. Um, you know, we, we work in the vacation rental side as well. So we understand that, you know, when people go to VRBO, which a lot of people have been doing to try and get out of their house, um, any photo that's attached to a potential vacation rental, there is a statistic about the value that they can charge per week attached to the visual on that property. So let's be honest, folks, it's the same for real estate. So if you lower the quality of that visual, you are lowering the value of that property and possibly your commission and possibly like how long it takes to sell that house. So those are really important things to think about. All right. So I know five years, that was, that was a lot. So this year and next year, like what are you guys focused on at True Place? Like what are you working on? So what we're focused on is working with teens and rising stars. Again, that infrastructure I spoke to to support them. They have really high bars. They have really high expectations. And I want to match that. You should always work with somebody who, who matches you mono and mono, you know, and your expectations and your efforts and your quality. Um, you know, I grew up in Central Florida. So I was basically raised right next to Disney and Universal. And they are world class. They don't do anything that is less than perfect. And so growing up around a community and environment where the level of creativity, the level of innovation was always so high and so amazing and inspiring that that's what I wanted to expect from myself. And so I, I want to bring that level of quality and, and the, the Disney and universal level of experience to, to everybody that I work with this year and next. I love it. We like Disney quite a bit ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> I want to take their class, actually. That's one of the classes that I, is on my radar is um, their class on customer service. I think it's fantastic. Um, every business has a secret weapon or something, someone, a habit they attribute a great deal of their success to. What is that for True Place? It's definitely the people. I don't know that I would say that it's secret, <laughs> but it's definitely the people. If you talk to anybody in customer service, if you call True Place to, to place an order or to ask a question, you will immediately realize that this is a different experience than what you get most of the time. Uh, so the, the talent of the photographer that shows up, um, the co-founders obviously that are amazing people. So I, I would definitely say the people. So why did y'all decide to be part of Real Producers? So we decided to be a part of Real Producers because we know the value of this community. We, we already understand, we've already experienced the, the value that this brings to our relationships we understand that this community is unlike anything else anywhere. And so we really wanted to be a part of it. Thank you so much. This community appreciates you too. Um, what is one inside tip you can give others to help when using your business? One inside tip I would give to others who are using our business is to talk to me first. <laughs> I, it's a very custom thing and I, I want to make sure that everybody has a custom experience. So feel free to call me or email me or, or to ping me on social. I want to make sure that everybody gets aligned with the best experience possible. What is one piece of advice that served you really well working in this industry, do you think? So a piece of advice that somebody gave me, let's see, who was it? Oh yeah, it was you, Kristen. <laughs> um, <laughs> you gave me the advice to just be myself. And I, I think that that has really stuck with me. So thank you. I, I think I remember you saying something about like, just be your awesome self. <laughs> and I was like, well, that sounds canned, but I'm going to go with it. <laughs> but, <laughs> but you were, you were right. Um, it just, it, it helped a lot. So thank you. Yeah. You have a wonderful, authentic self and yeah. You know, thank you for that. I didn't know you were going to say Where do you feel uh, the future of real estate is going? This is a fun out there question. Where, where do you think it's going now? <laughs> it, it, I guess some people will say that right now it feels like real estate is going nowhere really fast because there are so few listings. Uh, it just feels like we've been treading water in a, in a weird place. Uh, I'm personally curious to see what happens with MLS. There's a lot going on with Zillow and 
all these other companies that are that are bumping up against the ownership of MLS and, and the rules and things like that. So I'll be really curious to see what happens with that. I'll be really curious to see what happens with uh, with teams with listings that are public versus not public. I, I think this will all be very interesting to see how this shakes out because you've got a confluence of things making a perfect storm for a low listing inventory right now. And, and there's a lot of pressure. Uh, obviously when supply is scarce, everybody gets kind of like, <laughs> and so things that normally flow smoothly with, with listings and like, oh, you just put it on the last, you just do this, you just do that. Now, because supplies are so scarce, um, it, it's making everybody kind of rethink the normal. It is. I think it's going to be very interesting. I like the points you brought up. Well, um, is there anything else you'd like to share with the real producers, Rebecca? So I, I want to share that if I haven't seen you in a while or if we haven't talked in a while, please connect with me. I would love to, to just chat with you. I'd love to hear what's going on. Um, what, you know, if there's any way we can help each other, great. But honestly, I just, I miss seeing my friends. <laughs> we miss you too, Rebecca. Please do reach out to Rebecca and True Place. And, you know, you heard it here at DC Metro Real Producers. And, you know, thank you so much for being on, Rebecca. Thank you, Kristen. Bye, everybody. Bye. <laughs>